That's how I feel. <laughs> That's the sporty life for right now. Julie, Frank, how are you? <laughs> Good. Very excited for that little uh, Petaluma team here. Boy, yeah, 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 yeah. watching those players come out of the corn stalks and then uh, shake hands with, with Kevin Costner. That was pretty cool yeah. stuff. Mark, thanks. Yeah, there were so many yeah. great thanks, scenes Mark. in the yeah. pregame show. You got it. And our live news continues right now at 7 with Alex and mm -hmm. This is KTBU Fox 2 News at 7 on KTBU Plus. This is a life and death situation. Uh, we cannot wait any longer. Now at 7, desperate calls for something to be done about crime in Oakland, and they come as a new report shines a light on the problem. Plus. If it is your business, I think you should be in control of your business. And if you feel like you only want to serve those that are vaccinated, then by all means, just serve those that are vaccinated. No proof, no entry. The new indoor vaccine requirement forcing people in San Francisco to show they're fully vaccinated before going inside many businesses. San Francisco will soon become the first major city to require proof of full COVID-19 vaccination for many indoor activities. Welcome everyone to The 7 here on KTVU Plus. I'm Alex Savage. Heather will be along shortly. KTVU's Tom Vancar has the details tonight on the vaccine mandate that is set to roll out next week.